I'm Ben Smith. I'm here this evening at the home of Interwood Football Club uh, with Connor Coventry of West Ham United. Could you tell me a little bit about your time at Interwood? Um, I joined Interwood when I was around four and I uh, started training and then uh, started playing games around six, seven and uh, yeah, it was always good. Uh, we used to win a lot, yeah. Out of everything, what is the key thing that you could take away from your time at Interwood? Um, I think... Uh, when I was younger, it was a lot about the technical stuff, but then it teaches you never to not believe in yourself and give up, and uh, yeah, just keep playing. Which age did you move to West Ham? Um, under 11. Okay. What, what's it like playing in that academy environment compared to Inswood? Um, at the start, it wasn't too different. Was, uh, I think at both places, there's an emphasis on winning, but also uh, playing the right way. But um, yeah, there's a emphasis on the development more than winning but it's important as well. You made your debut for Ireland under the 21s earlier in the year, how uh, did that feel? Under 16s. Under yeah. 16s? Yeah. Uh, yeah it was good, Yeah, it was a tough game against Turkey but yeah it was a good experience. What can you take away from that game that you perhaps learnt in your time at Interwood? Um, I think just to don't let mistakes affect you, because obviously there's a big crowd and you can let it affect you, you just have to uh, get over it quickly and move on to the next thing. If you can take away one thing that Danny's taught you, yeah. what would it be? Um, I would say to always be prepared. Uh, he used to tell me to pack my own parachute, uh, not worry about, don't let my mum and dad do it, just do things myself. What type of player are you? Um, I'm not sure, uh, centre midfield, a bit box to box. Which of those traits would you take away from your time at Interwood? Um, a lot of, Danny worked a lot of me with fitness and um, just all of the technical skills needed. The uh, short passing, long passing, finishing, tackling. So uh, quite an all round thing, yeah. Okay, can you tell me a little bit about your goals and ambitions for the future? Um, well, I'd like to play in the Premier League and internationally at a first team level. How does it differ playing in this environment, coming from grassroots football to academy football with West Ham and under 16 level with Ireland? Um, I think because of the age there's a bit more tactical uh, instructions but it's not too different in the, uh, the emphasis of the way we want to play and stuff. Okay. And finally, what if you were to, if I was to bring my son down and say that I wanted to bring him into it, yeah. what would you say, what would you say, the one thing that you could tell him? Um, to just believe himself and listen to what the coaches are saying because uh, yeah, they have good knowledge themselves. Can you tell me a little bit about your finest moment in an Interwood shirt? Um, yeah, I think winning the London Cup was good, yeah. Um, yeah, probably that, yeah. Can you recall any moments from that final? Um, no, nah, not really, no. Nah. No? Just remember the goals. Your European experiences with Ireland? Yeah. Is there anything that you learnt within this environment that you can transfer across into Europe? Um, yeah, I think uh, there's a lot of emphasis on not giving the ball away. And uh, yeah, we talk that from young to keep the ball and it's important at that level because you can get punished. Can you tell me a little bit about your mindset when you go went into that environment at under 16 level with Ireland? Um, I think you just have to be prepared and uh, just confident in yourself and don't worry about the occasion but just treat it as another game. Have you got any pre-match pre -match routines? Uh, no, not really, just eating the right foods. Okay. Excellent. Perfect. Thanks.